So I just came across this concept called Agent Lightning, and it's all about making AI agents smarter without much coding. Wait, seriously? You mean you can optimize these agents without rewriting tons of code? How does that even work? Exactly. It seems like you can just drop in this helper function and boom, your agent starts learning. That's wild, but I wonder if there are limitations. Like, can it really adapt to any framework? Good point. They claim it works with various frameworks like Langchain and OpenAI's SDK. But is it as seamless as they say? Um, I'd be skeptical. How do you ensure it doesn't break existing setups? Seems risky. Right, you'd think there are DB compatibility issues, but they mention it keeps things minimal, focusing on your ideas. So, it sounds like the goal is to streamline the process. But isn't there a chance of oversimplification? Definitely. That makes me think about how much understanding gets lost when we simplify complex systems. Exactly. There's this balance between usability and depth. If they cut corners, that could lead to unexpected outcomes. And they use reinforcement learning and other algorithms. I wonder if those can be applied effectively across different tasks. That's an interesting mix. But isn't reinforcement learning notoriously difficult to implement well? Totally, there's a lot of fine-tuning needed. But if they've cracked that code, it could be a game-changer. I'm intrigued but cautious. Plus, they say you can optimize multiple agents at once. How does that even work? Well, it seems like you can selectively tune agents in a multi-agent system. Imagine the coordination required. That sounds intense, but what if one agent's optimization disrupts another's balance? Would that be a risk? It could be there's always that potential for chaos in multi-agent systems. It's like a social network of AIs. Wow, that's a cool analogy. But what if the agents start competing instead of collaborating? That could get messy. Right, it raises questions about alignment and cooperation. I wonder if they've thought about that. I hope so. They mention a central hub for tasks and resources. But is that flexible enough? I guess it must be, but if the hub gets overloaded, it might slow everything down, right? Exactly. It's like trying to manage a busy intersection without traffic lights. Could lead to congestion. Speaking of traffic, think about how these agents would handle real-time data. It's a bit chaotic. True, real-time adaptability is key. They'd have to process a ton of data quickly. That's the challenge, and if they can't, then what's the point of optimizing them right? Exactly. It's like having a car that can't handle turns. You still need control and reliability. And this is where the implications for AI in real-world applications come in. What do you think? Well, if implemented well, it could revolutionize industries. But if mismanaged, the fallout could be huge. Absolutely, it could either be a breakthrough or a disaster, depending on how it's approached. And that's where responsible AI comes in. They mention compliance with Microsoft's responsible AI standard. Right, but does just having standards guarantee that the technology is used ethically? Good question. Standards are a start, but the implementation is everything. It's all about the humans behind it. Exactly. It feels like there's a lot of hype here, but the real test will be in real-world applications. Totally. I'm curious to see if they provide enough documentation and examples to support users. They've got examples listed, which is promising, but we'll see how those translate into actual usage. I'm all for innovation, but I think we need to keep a healthy skepticism. It's important. Agreed, this could be a fascinating journey, but we must tread carefully and critically, right? Definitely. So, what do you think will be the biggest takeaway from all this? I think it's the potential for AI agents to evolve without heavy lifting, but we must remain vigilant. Absolutely. Let's keep digging into this. There's so much more to uncover in the AI world. Totally, and who knows what innovations are on the horizon with tools like Agent Lightning. Exactly. But it's crucial to remember that with great power comes great responsibility. Well said, it's like navigating a tightrope between progress and ethics in AI. For sure. And that's the exciting and sometimes daunting part of exploring AI's future. Right, so what's next on our exploration list? More AI tools or diving deeper into ethics? Let's mix it up. We could look at both and see how they interact. Sounds like a plan.
Sounds perfect. Let's keep the conversation going and see where it takes us. Absolutely. I can't wait to see what insights await us in that journey.